It's a radio frequency identification, or RFID tag. The same technology used to tag animals to help reunite a pet with its owner, RFID has now won Food and Drug Administration approval for use in humans. But it occurs to me, I've got them in my dogs. Why wouldn't I have them in small children, too? Vera Chip, subsidiary of publicly traded Applied Digital, has added Tommy Thompson to its board of directors. Molly Phillips hopes her worst nightmare never happens again. To make sure, she had a new device called the Vera Chip a computer chip about the size of a grain of rice placed under her skin. If I had this chip, I could travel all over the world. That would give me the freedom of living a life without bound. An Ohio company has become the first American firm to implant silicon chips in employees to track their every move. Don't be surprised if your company asks to tag you. Then there is the issue of privacy and whether employers might start demanding employees get the chip implanted as a form of ID. And in the 1980s, you know, you take a polygraph test to get a job. In the 1990s, it was drug testing. Uh, a little later on, it was reading your email. And then each step along the line, you start to ask the question, you know, is, is the law going to create any zones of safety? Actually, it's an inexpensive solution um, versus a retina scanner or a fingerprint ID. Those, those solutions are rather expensive. A retina scan, a fingerprint ID. Now, many of us carry around an equivalent to this tiny little chip already. Only, they don't look like this. They look like this. Finished. We now have over 60 hospitals that have agreed to implement the system, so that time is nearing. The, w the way it works is it actually picks up and amplifies ambient electromagnetic energy from the reader devices. And if you have one of these things in your arm and you get within range of a, a powerful electromagnetic field, it can actually burn you. Is there a vast RFID conspiracy out there that is plot? They would say this is a slippery slope. This is the first thing. This is where you lull us into a false sense of security. We all get these things, and then the next thing you know, I don't know, We're it's making like the, soil and green. Like a tr yeah, the truth. So that time is nearing to now. It's closer than you think. Welcome to the future.